show y'all. Let's talk about not paying for things that we could do ourselves. Okay? So my ideology is why would I pay somebody for something I could do myself? No. And it doesn't take that long. I'm talking about my lashes, okay? So one eye is iron and the other one is not. Uh, we can say this to get ready with me. I'm not getting ready for nothing, but, well, for tomorrow. Uh, but, essentially, I went to the hair store the other day, as always. The hair store and the dollar store, Dollar Tree will never miss me, okay? Um, but I went to the hair store the other day because I wanted to buy some more individuals. I do have my Kiss uh, video that I have up where I did my lashes for that. But, but um, these are more, those are clusters. So the ones that I, would look, I wanted were not there. So I was like, oh my God, what am I gonna do? So she was like, Let's get the individuals. And I was like, I don't want to. Because I feel like the clusters, you literally just pop, 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 and they pop on. These, and she was like, oh, you can stack the individuals. Great, nobody got time for that. But I don't have no other choice but to have time for it this time. Because I got them. I was, you know. I saw her lashes and I was like, oh my God, that's so, so pretty. She's like, I went to the person. I said, well, how much she charged you? And she said, $220. Baby, give me them lashes for $3.99. <laughs> and a glue for $3.99. And baby, I'm about to go take every bit of 15 minutes and do it. And no lie, they are pretty. I'm not sure how long they last, but just like with me with wigs i switch it up too much for me to be paying all that money hers were gorgeous though no lie she did whoever did her her extensions did a very good job but guess what God, guess what we not about to do that i'm about to pay no 200 dollars for no lashes and then as soon as one fall out because guess what they don't fall out baby lashes are like a car when you take it off the car lot, like, it depreciates as soon as, as soon as you get out the shop. Cause guess what's gonna drop a lash or two? A lash or two will drop. So you might as well just be upset. And then I really want to ask her how much are the refills and how often she go get them done. But I mean, everybody has that thing that they choose choose to splurge on. So they may be her thing, but I just, when it comes to hair, hair, I'm not trying to sit in no shop for 42, 32, 82 hours because I've had my experience with being in the hair shop for hours upon hours upon hours and that just no longer serve me. And I think that's just a thing now. Well, I'm not going to say that's a thing now because I do see some people who go and go get their hair done and, you know, leave right out. I don't know why this one doing this. Okay. Let's see. I'm trying to pop it up. I'm going to have to put one in between now. But... Yeah, I just don't see myself per, uh, paying for something I can do myself. <sighs> Even, like, I'm not going to lie. Guess what? All the time, the first thing, people are, oh my God, your nails are so pretty. Where did you get them from? Down to the shed. Because I'm not standing in no nail shop. Now, I'm not going to lie. I do go to the nail shop for my feet. Because I need that lady to slap my feet like she's supposed to okay but once I started seeing the amount of money that I was spending like I just buy
I don't know why. You see that last bed uncooperative? We're going to make it work, though. We're going to make it do what it did. But, yeah, the the people who do nails most of the time, they, they had a lady, she came in to my job the other day. She was like, oh, my God, your nails are so pretty. What are you going to get? She in. Hey. A dollar something. You drill your nails right. And guess what? Can't nobody tell. And if they can, oh, well. But once you learn how to do them, like, I could, I could do some nails in a matter of minutes. And I switch my nails out probably every week. They know, like, listen, the last pair, I don't remember where I got them from. I actually feel like I got them not from Shein. I think I got those from the hair store. Now, those were the devil, Okay. When I say the devil, because them things was cracking and popping like some uh, Rice Krispie treats, okay? Snap, snap, crackling, and popping. I don't know what went wrong with them, they, but they were cracking like on the sides. And like once they start cracking on the side, sides, it's going to mess with your real nails. So that is not what's up. And one thing about doing your lashes, one side always gonna be, I think there's, there's anything. One side always gonna slay and the other side is gonna be looking redonkulous. So, but yeah, ladies, learn how to do stuff because guess what? And you know what? This was before even COVID. It was a time, uh, I remember when I was younger and my mom and my dad had just built the house and I think my mama ended up losing her job. And that that's the that's when I learned about, you know, just taking the initiative to try to learn how to do stuff. And then once you learn how to do it and you do it good, sometimes, baby, you get paid. Because when I tell you, people used to be at my house, like on beauty shop, getting hair, quick weaves. I used to do it all, y'all. I'm talking about quick weaves, lashes. What else I used to do? Quick wigs, lashes. Um, I never did nails. I couldn't. I don't like that fume. But I definitely used to do some hair, baby, back in the day. You want a filthy quick wave? I was your girl. But just like anything else, you know. People don't pay you like you because you are a kitchen beautician. They don't be wanting to pay you no money to do it and you be looking cute. I mean, not be looking cute. Yeah, they be looking cute. I know my daughter going to want me to do her lashes next. But, yeah, learn how to do some stuff on your own. It wasn't just, like I said, it wasn't for COVID. Because, baby, COVID had shut down. Now, no lie. Now, that's when I learned how to do my nails. That's when I learned how to just do nails. Because, listen, and when I say do nails, I mean press-ons. I do not mean uh, what you call it. Because I tried to do the different nail kits. That, baby, that did not work for me. That was not my ministry. I tried it. It failed miserably. And I was just like, okay, I know my limits now. But I definitely, uh, that's when the press on came to be for me, was doing COVID. I never learned how to do my feet. And what's so crazy is that's all they do is put gel on it. I get gel um, on my feet because it just lasts longer. And it's better for me. So normally, like if I, like when I try to get regular polish, baby, it's cracking and all kind of stuff. I did get some gel a couple of months ago. And baby, I don't know if they, <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. It wasn't their stuff. That lady say, it's your toe. It is your toe. And she wasn't lying, it was my toe. Okay. It was my toe, uh, and it cracked. Cause baby, I went there, I say, did y'all change the polish? Cause, my nail didn't crack. 
and it was two of them, baby. She was like, oh, no, what you're not going to do is talk about our stuff. Okay? She said, it's your toe. And it was my little crack, crackety crack toe, baby. She said, look, look. <laughs> and it was my toe, y'all. It, um, I don't know why, but it did, it cracked. And baby, she, she corrected me. She said, what you're not going to do is talk about our stuff. I think this is going to be enough for this one. But yeah, learn how to do stuff on your own, just in case. You never know, you know? When, you know, you never know when money gets tight. And all the time, it, it don't have to be about money getting tight. It could just be, listen, I want to save money, and that's saving my cause baby, listen, when that girl say $200 for what, sis? But, I mean, it was, like I said, don't get me wrong, they were gorgeous. I don't know about $200 worth. And even when my nails, y'all, nails were getting ridiculous, and I know, like, when I end up talking to my nail tech, she was telling me, like, you know, stuff, everything has gone up since COVID. Like, everything. And I, I understand that and I respect it. Baby, because I stopped going to my other little, um, uh, my other little place. I started back going to my old place since I just was getting my toes done. Because with the other ones, I was getting my nails and my toes. But it still wasn't high. Like, I think I'll leave out paying like one, one something. Because, baby, when I be seeing these babies on YouTube and hearing the prices they pay for nails. But you know who I do love? I love Mr. Carr. The Carr, baby, she will. I don't know if she always, you know, use, but I was looking at her, her Tokyo, uh, her Tokyo vlogs and I saw that she um you know was using press homes and I'm like that's that is what's up sis like listen I'm the press home queen now I had all my co-workers by uh and we was out we all have uh drills okay <laughs> baby open us up a little nail shop okay we all got drills. But that's it. I'm finished. Um...